hello guys uh, welcome to ambitronics so today in this video tutorial i will show you how we can uh, basically uh, update our uh, system uh, with windows 11 on unsupported devices uh, like we have some requirement for uh, windows 11 as you know uh, if you don't know like uh, what requirements are there uh, then uh, you just uh, install one app that is pc health checkup check then here uh, if you just go there and if you just click on this check now uh, i can hear you will see some of the things like uh, tpm 2.0 must be supported and enabled on this pc tpm is something like trusted platform module and uh, it should be 2.0 basically minus 1.2 as as you can see here so this is one thing and other things some processors they have already predefined microsoft has already defined like those should be uh, um, like more than a seventh generation processor so these two things uh, should be there so this is th this, these are the things uh, which are not matching in my case so i'll show you how you can uh, basically install uh, windows 11 now so okay so let's uh, get let's get started so what we'll do we'll just uh, uh, close this window and we will do first uh, we'll just uh, download windows windows 10 so we'll click it here and here uh, media inspiration tool uh, is downloaded now we'll just double click on this okay so uh, here uh, you can see this uh, type of uh, thing will come when you will just uh, click on that uh, installation media now you have to just applicable notices and license terms you just need to uh, just uh, uh, click on accept So uh, this type of uh, window you will get. Now here instead of clicking upgrade this PC now you have to click on this create installation media because we have to create ISO file. Now we will just click on next and here language English uh, edition windows 10 architecture 64 bit uh, this is fine. Now next again here uh, USB instead of USB flash drive uh, we just click on ISO file. Uh, now we will click on next and here we will just go to uh, D drive and here one folder I had just created windows I'll just uh, save this uh, file with with name let's say windows 10 and I'll just save it So okay. Okay, so we'll just finish it now. So we can uh, go to our windows, uh, here we can see windows.10.iso So what I'll do, I'll just extract it, uh, extract to windows 10 So this is the folder now what will we do we will just uh, again go to uh, our browser and here we will just download windows 11 and here to download windows 11 uh, download windows 11 disk image iso for x64 we will click on this select download here we will click on windows 11 multi edition uh, iso for x64 devices and here we will just click uh, on download now now uh, it will ask for the language so we'll choose English okay and we'll just confirm it now this uh, download six, Windows 11 English 64 bit uh, thing will come so we'll just click on it and here uh, it will just start uh, getting downloaded 
so it will take uh, a time as you can see our uh, process is uh, uh, already it's processing it is it will take uh, near about seven to eight minutes okay so installation is completed uh, here you can see uh, this is uh, windows 11 uh, in our download section now i'll just extract it uh, to windows 11 and what will we do we will just now copy uh, one uh, file from this windows 11 folder to uh, that windows 10 folder so what that file is i'll show you so we'll click on this windows 11 and here we'll just go to first we'll just uh, let uh, let's uh, let's go to d drive and go to windows and here in this windows 10 go to sources and here just search install yeah install.est so uh, this is the file so what will we do we will just uh, click on it and we will just uh, delete it okay now we will just again go to uh, our downloads And here in downloads, uh, we will just click on uh, this Windows 11 folder and here we will go to sources and here we will search install and here uh, there install.esd we had de deleted. Now this install.wim we have to just uh, copy. So copy it and we will just uh, paste it in this windows 10 folder and we'll paste it here we go okay so it's copying yes we have finished this step step also so what will we do now now we will just go to uh, uh, we'll come outside and this windows 10 setup uh, executable we need to uh, uh, like we need to execute the setup file so what I'll do okay so we will just uh, uh, execute this so 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 you will see this type of message like install windows 10 but uh, what we have to do we have to click or change how windows setup downloads updates so we will just click on it, it and uh, not right now we will click and we will click on next this way you will not uh, lose your uh, uh, application and data also we'll click on accept So here now you can see ready to install you won't be able to use your pc while windows install uh, install save and close your files before you begin uh, so install windows 11 pro key person files and apps so we'll install it uh, uh, by clicking it uh, this uh, click button so we'll install it now So okay, uh, this uh, Windows installation is happening. Here you can say uh, you can see installing Windows 10 is uh, written because actually we had just we had just uh, copied uh, that uh, install dot est uh, install dot wim from Windows 11 to Windows 10 uh, sources folder. 
so that's where this windows 10 is coming but ultimately we, we will get windows 11 here so this is the way so uh, after uh, this uh, this is this is completed uh, our system will get restart and we will just see the windows 11 here So here we will put our pin. So it's uh, just uh, getting it ready. So now uh, as you can see this is uh, basically Windows uh, 11. Here you can see the taskbar is changed now, updated. And here, here, so we just go to uh, properties. And here, uh, here you can see uh, device uh, specifications. Uh, this is and here uh, version is 23H2 and uh, addition Windows 11 Pro. So this way you can uh, install Windows 11, update Windows 11 in your unsupported device. Uh, if you have any doubt regarding this, just feel free to comment us below. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching this video.